It's a great day for hockey cards, and today we're going to take a look at 2015-16 Upper Deck Portfolio Hockey. Uh, one autograph and one memorabilia card in each box. We're going to get 8 cards per pack and 20 packs per box. So this was a one-year product from Upper Deck, meaning it came out one year, it came out in the McDavid rookie year, and that's it. It does have McDavid in it, so it is worth purchasing, in my opinion. Uh, you can find this fairly cheap most places. I bought this for, I think, 35 US. Um, bought this a little while ago, been holding on to it. Uh, so let's get right into the break. So you also get a decent number of cards in here. You get 20 cards per box, eight cards per pack. I think I opened one other box of this on the channel before, if I'm not mistaken. And uh, we pulled some McDavid stuff out of it, so hopefully we will get the same out of this guy here. And there, Wayne Gretzky, Wayne Gretzky on the box. And let's go, let's dig into it. So I will say that I think these base cards are the ugliest base cards in the history of, of hockey cards. Uh, there's Tevu Teravine, and the photography in this set's pretty good, but just like, oof, the brown border is just hideous. The back doesn't help much. I don't know. What do you guys think? Uh, can you think of a set that's uglier than this? If so, let me know in the comments. Uh, Ryan Gets Laugh, Brian Little, we've got a... Upper Deck Portfolio Black and White Art Card, Bobby Clark. Really nice. Simeon Varlamov, Dougie Gilmore, and Eric Stahl. Oh, and then Corey Perry. I think we got, do we? Three, four, five, six, seven. Now we got eight cards there. I'm so used to opening product that has no cards in it. I thought there was too many cards in there. SP Game used the one-pack jobs. Ruined me stuff where you actually get a lot of content. Peter Morazic, Mike Ribeiro, Braden Shen, and we've got a Vladimir Tarasenko. So these white border cards, I believe, are short prints on the set. Cart Gillies, Jonathan Taves, another Vladimir Tarasenko, and Jacob Vorchek. Kari Lettinen, Brent Seabrook, Jack Johnson, Daniel Sedin, and we've got a rookie phenom of Shea Theodore. Nick Foligno, Taylor Hall, and Double J. So most of Upper Deck's products, once again, have been pushed back, so I don't think we actually have another re new release for a couple more weeks. James Neal, Patrick Marlowe, Mark Giordano, we've got Brent Burns, that's a great picture there, and we've got rookie phenom Zach Fucale. Ovi, Sagan, and Pavel Bure. TJ Oshi, Marion Gabrick, Mike Green, and we've got a wire photos of Jack Eichel. So that this is his rookie year as well. This is another subset of cards that, I don't know, just doesn't do it for me in here. <laughs> it's uh, black and white. Uh, it's supposed to be press wire photos. Um, but I'm not sure anybody sends them as black and white anymore. Braden Holpe. Gino Malkin. John Carlson and Claude Giroux. Flyers are on fire right now. I think as I'm recording this, they've won nine games in a row, which is insane. Michael Bodker, Alex Petrangelo, Cal Palmieri, Thomas Vanek, and we've got another wire photo of Clark Gillies. Johnny Goudreau, Martin Jones, and the Moose. Justin Williams, Kyle Pozo, Bobby Lou, 
and another wire photo of Sam Bennett showing his uh, hat trick pucks. Pavel Datsuk, Kuzi, Andre Kopitar, and Shane Gostaspare. OEL, Kevin Hayes, it looks like we're going to have our patch in this one, or our uh, memorabilia, Brock Nelson, and we've got Ryan Kessler, Black Swatch, Bobby Clark, and David Krejci. Travis Hamannick. Anthony Duclair, Matthew Perot, John Klingberg, and we've got another wire photo of, this is Jamie Benn. And the one thing I do like about these cards is at least the, I kind of like it when they put the photo in context. So like there's the photo and on the back of the card is a description of the game. And what's going on. So that's kind of nice to always know where like the picture came from or in some cases in some sets, you know, they'll put a piece of memorabilia and say what it was from. Cal Turris, Leo Komarov, and Dr. Dre. Tyler Ennis, Corey Crawford, Phil the Thrill, and Juicy Saros. Rookie, he's having a great year. He's probably not too far out of taking over for Pekka Rinne. His career winds down. Jamie Benn, Shea Weber, Scott Hartnell, and Mark Shifley. Roman Yossi, Nazim Kadri, TJ Brody, We've got a rookie phenom of Jean-Francois Jean Barube, which I do not think uh, do not think he's made it in the NHL. Victor Hedman, we've got Thomas Tatar, Nick Bugstad, and Guy Lafleur. I really always like sets where you can pull some of the some of the legends of the game actually one of the things I like. I know some people groan when they pull a legend out of a modern product, but I really like that. Kevin Shattenkirk, Evander Kane, Duncan Keith, got Natty Mack, and we've got a rookie phenom of Artemi Panarin, who is doing his damnedest to try and get the Rangers into the playoffs this year. Super Mario, Joe Pavelski, and Marc-Andre Fleury. Sammy Votnin, Christopher Stieg, Doug Harvey, and another wire photo, and this would be Noah Hannafin. Patrick Sharp, The Nuge, Nicholas Lidstrom, and Adam Henrique. Getting down to it, we have three, we've got six packs left. Like I said, these boxes are kind of nice because you do get a lot of content. The photography is pretty good, but card design. Woof. Woof. Johnny Boychuk. Chris Letang. Mika Zabenejad. And we've got our auto, and it's Charles Houdon. Sticker auto. Not the best auto, but uh, not bad. Nicholas Backstrom. Justin Falk. Jonathan Quick and Alexander Barkov. Alexander Steen, Sean Monahan, Henrik Zetterberg, Johnny Gibson, and a rookie phenom of Jack Eichel. That's nice. Eichel's having a great year. I hope that uh, Buffalo can eventually get it turned around for the guy. Andrew Ladd. Ryan Kessler and Patches.
Henrik Sedin, Martin Hansel, Mike Camilleri, Bo Horvat, and we've got another rookie phenom of Oscar Lindbergh. Mike Hoffman, Gabe Landeskog, and P.K. Subban. Wayne Simmons, Steven Stamkos, Miko Koivu, we've got Ben Bishop, and we've got, oh, look at that. It's Mary Lemieux. Going around Corey Hirsch there. Blake Wheeler, Brian Leach, and The Bob. Louis Erickson, Dion Phaneuf, Victor Rask, and we've got Christoph Berchi from Minnesota. Don't know him. Yuri Hoodler, Bobby Orr, Al McInnes, and Nikita Kucherov. Joe Thornton, Rasmus Rustalainen, Mike Smith, that's a really cool photo. Devin Dubnik, and we've got another black and white art card of Noah Hannafin. Matt Zuccarello, who recently... Uh, oh, no, that's not Zuccarello, that's actually Zabinijad that scored the five goals recently. Mark Stone and Bobby Ryan, which is pretty remarkable. Last pack. Patrick Kane, Brandon Saad, Eric Johnson, and we've got a rookie phenom of Nick Ritchie. Aaron Ekblad, Ryan Miller. Ah, oh, look at look at the outfit there, man. The classic Canucks. That's pretty bad. Morgan Riley, Lanny McDonald. So there you have it. That is a box. Of 2015 2016 upper deck portfolio not a very remarkable box like i said i really like the photography in this set they've got some great pictures but as far as the design it is a super super ugly card design in my opinion let me know what you think in the comments maybe you think it's better um i think this is actually product is a pretty good deal this is this was not the best box but as far as budget collecting um there is some neat stuff you can pull out of here, and you do get a lot of content for your money. Like I said, I paid 35 US for this box, so that's a pretty good deal. Uh, but thanks for watching. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you like the channel, please hit that subscribe button. Uh, and uh, we will see you next time with a different break. Bye.